Palatoy is Britain's biggest toy company. Three years ago, the firm announced a massive £74 million turnover and a four-year plan to consolidate their position. That plan ended in today's news, which has cut the workforce at Colville to less than half. The demise of the Colville operation began two years ago when production of the Action Man doll, popular for 18 years, was stopped. Then, a year ago, Star Wars, an equally successful product, was halted almost overnight. It left the workforce to carry out just assembly operations. Managing director Peter Waterman said the redundancies were unavoidable. He said competition was intense and it would cost millions of pounds to introduce new manufacturing processes. The industry is so volatile, he confessed, ranges become outdated within a couple of years. But he said the move would put the company on a much sounder footing. But it's a move which has taken the workforce totally by surprise. We're completely devastated with what's happened. As I said, we, we didn't expect this. Although we knew the company was in a certain amount of trouble, we, you know, we didn't, just didn't expect production to finish on the Colville site. What's this going to mean to the workforce here that are going to lose their jobs? Well, there's very little work in the area. I mean, we're working in an area where the mining community has been run down. We're in a position where we've possibly got the Greaveses as well. That was a major employer. They've been reduced, so we was possibly one of the white oaks, if you like, of the area, and we've just gone. It's going to mean very well a lot of difficulty to the people who are leaving. The companies say the redundancies are unavoidable, would you agree with that? No, I believe that, is, I still honestly believe that uh, we are a viable company, I believe that we've got an excellent workforce, I produce, we produce excellent products. Palatoy is a part of the international General Mills firm based in America. It'll continue to produce toys such as Britain's most popular board game, Trivial Pursuit, and also Care Bears, but in other countries, mostly the Far East. The unions are having talks with management, but have already consoled themselves to the worse. The game for them.